Hi folks, I'm back with some more battery experiments, but before I get started on that, I wanted to give you an update on uh, yesterday's uh, battery. This is the one that I made yesterday, and it's now 24 hours old, and I haven't given it a drop of water. It's been sitting out on the table here all this time, <coughs> and I've run all these uh, cycles on it. This is the 20. This will be the 29th uh, cycle for this, and the last peak was on the 26th cycle at uh, 1.064 volts and 35.2 uh, milliamps. All right, so we're going to go with 1.05. Okay, so we're at 1.05, and our amps are. 3, 2, 1, 41, new fucking high again, so there you have it, you've seen it yourself, 41, we're now four times, almost four times higher, more powerful than we started off at, actually more than that if you go by the milliwatts, okay, now this, uh, this experiment here is going to be another cell just like the one I made yesterday, where I just took titanium dioxide and glue, painted on the zinc and another layer and then put a layer of uh, uh, graphite and glue on the graph oil except this time I've got two layers of uh, graphite and glue on the, uh, on the positive electrode so <coughs> we're just going to uh, put these together again add no, no free water to it and we'll see what the, the differences are Last time we started at uh, 11.3 milliamps, and we'll see if we get any higher than that this time. And it's about the same amount of drying time. It's been, I don't know, three hours or so since I made those cells. And you could probably fit these things together earlier than that, but I just wanted to do it about the same as what I did yesterday. All right, so let's check our voltage now and see what we got. And oh, look at there! Two layers of graphite. Look at our voltage jumped up to 103, 103.4. All right, and our amps are three, two, one, twenty-two. Almost exactly double what we got with one coat of graphite. Show you, you see how fast this one's getting back up to 90%. Look at that, we're already in the point, point nine six nine one or two. So that is uh, right there, it's already back to 90%. So it also helped the recharge, self charge rate, looks like. All right, I'll be back. All right, I'm back again, and I'm not going to wait on it to get the full charge. I'm just going to measure it. It's already slowed down pretty slow, and it's at 1.016. Uh, so we're going to test it right there. 1.016, and our amps are 3, 2, 1, 22.6, I think, that time. I'll be back in a few minutes. All right, I'm back, and we're on the uh, crystal biocell uh, with the double graphite on it again, and we are now back to, uh, we're actually above our last voltage, we're at 1.02, 1.02, and our amps are 3, 2, 1, 23, 4, creeping up just like it should. Alright, I'm back to the first crystal cell that I made yesterday and we're going to test it again no matter what it's at and it's at uh, 1.024 1.024 and our amps are this is the 30th one I think right here alright, 3, 2, 1 42. Alright, new high again. Two in a row. At least on the amps. Alright, that cell's doing great. 
Alright, I'll be back. Alright, I'm back again. This will be the fourth discharge for uh, this is the this crystal cell, the one we made today. And we are at uh, 101. Okay, 101.1. Our amps are three, two, one, twenty-one something. All right, I'll be back. All right, I'm back. This is the the first crystal cell, and you can see we're at one point oh three six. So we're going to test it right there for the thirty-first time and see what kind of volts we got. Our amps we got. All right, ready? Three, two, one. Forty-five, five. A new high. Again, three in a row. This is the second crystal cell. And this one now should have climbed up pretty high because it's been. Uh, oh, look at that shit. One point oh nine two. We'll call it uh, 1.093. And our amps are 3, 2, 1, 37.5. Another, uh, there's a record high, 37.5. Alright, I'll be back. I'm back. We'll go back to this is the new, the new crystal cell. Is now at uh, 108. 10, we're going to switch to 108.2. Our amps are 3, 2, 1, 41. So another increase on that one. Alright, and now for the, the first crystal cell. I hope I just didn't short that out with that other cell. Is now at 1026. I'm going to switch to 1027. Alright, 1027. And the amps are 3, 2, 1, 45, 1. Alright. I'm back with test number 33, I think, on the, the first crystal cell, and we are now at 1041. 1041. And our amps are 3, 2, 1, 45, something again. All right, boy, that one's last uh, three in a row have been 45 something. All right, let's see where our other crystal cell is. This is number two. This one's still climbing at 110. About 10 seconds between clicks on that. But uh, hell, is, and it's uh, quite a bit lower. 90, we'll say 972. 972, and the amps are 3, 2, 1, 2039. So that one may be getting ready for, to make another jump, it looks like. Dropped off a little bit. Alright, I'll be back. Alright, I'm back again. And this time, there's a little change. We have on the first crystal cell, 0.957, and it seems to be stuck right there for a long time. So we're going to just measure it right there. We'll go 9.58, and that's quite a bit less than it should be. Alright. And 3, 2, 1, 
149. Huh. Well, it went up again. I think maybe the drop in voltage is a sign. All right. Okay, now let's see what the... Ooh, I almost shorted it out. Let's see what the second crystal cell is doing. And we're at uh, 101.6. Getting ready to switch to 101.7. So we'll measure it right there. 101.7. things are climbing. Interesting, uh, this one's already about caught up to uh, this one. Just went to 49 milliamps and the second one is only uh, is less than half its old. But it started with twice as much graphite and is caught right back up and it started twice as high. That's pretty uh, significant right there. Alrighty, I'll be back. Alright, I'm back again. And here's all the data points that we've got so far, uh, 34 of them for the, the cell now, which is two days old. Uh, here's what it looks like in a graph. Now, how about that? So here's pretty much yesterday's, and here's today. It looks like yesterday was a warm-up for today because <laughs> it really skyrocketed uh, today in the power. So uh, looking at it like that, it makes you wonder what's going to happen tomorrow on it. Well, we'll find out. So, uh, stay tuned for that one. Alright, we got time, so let's test this thing one more time. See what we got. And, this is cell number one. So, point nine seven seven. Here is our amps, our 3, 2, 1, 51, 2, I think. So we're still, we're heading on up. Alright, now let's uh, see what uh, cell number 2 has for us. Unbelievable, these things just keep climbing. And our volts are, it is dropping, 0.738. So they went down a little bit. Well, I'll let you know what happens on that. Something's changing in that cell, though. All right. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.